All right, time to see the PS5 for the first time ever in my life. Here we go. Three, two, one. It is September 17th, 2020. 3.20 a.m. The day we can finally pre-order the PS5. So here we go. So right now I'm on Twitter. Yeah, I can see number one trending is Best Buy. That's where I actually want to pre-order. And it says right there, customers say they're struggling to get one. Oh boy. Alright, let's see if I can get one. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Alright, so let's go to Best Buy. Let's see if we can actually pre-order. Hopefully I get lucky. Here we go. There it is, pre-order PS5. I'm gonna get the $500 version. Here we go, pre-order. Uh-oh. And there it is, the PS5 officially pre-ordered. All right, now time to go to sleep. We're here. This is gonna be me buying a PS5 on launch day. Wish me luck. Where are the PS5s? Uh oh. What is Mario doing next to the PS4 stuff? I got a PS5 right here. Oh my god, I need to run before this thing gets water, water damage. Oh my god. Oh my god, it is officially here. The PS5 has been secured. Like, look at this thing. Like, she's a little wet. That sounded kind of wrong, but I think uh, the PS5 will be okay. But look at this box. This, is, this box is so much better. Oh my god, so freaking heavy. This box is so much better than the PS4 launch one. I can't really turn it because this thing is so heavy. Hold on. All right, so here's the back. I've never seen this box. Oh, this has 825 gigabytes. Play like, play like never before. Dang. And this has a handle. So yeah, I got the PS5 from Best Buy. And I really thought there was going to be like, like a lot of people. Like there's literally like no one. It was like, Best Buy was dead. I don't even know what time I even went. Hold on, let me check. So I went around like 11.30, 12-ish. So... Yeah, I only saw like one guy like buy it uh, while I was there, so. Oh yeah, and I almost forgot that. I also got some PSN codes for you guys, like always. And I got five, and they each contain like uh, $25. So yeah, they're five in. So you can buy anything from the PlayStation Store. If you guys got a PS5, you can get some PS5 games. Or if you're stuck with the PS4, you can like save it when you get a PS5 or something like that. But it's up to you. And if you guys want one, all you have to do is just leave a like on the video, subscribe, because I'm going to be uploading a lot of PS5 videos since I just got it. And then just comment your PSN name so I can message you with the code. None of these are even used, you guys can see. So yeah, none of them. So let's unbox this when I get home. Oh my god. It's pretty crazy that this is what I'm going to play for the next six to seven years. Oh my god. All right, so now it's finally time to unbox this. So here's the front again. 8K, 4K, 120, HDR. And then here's this side. And then here's the back. And apparently you need to be 10 years old to own a PS5. And I don't get why this is 825 gigabytes. Like they should've just done one terabyte. And then here's this side. And the reason why I got the disc version is because maybe one day I'll get like a PS5 game disc and it's just nice to have and also I can make videos on like what happens when you put like a PS4 game in or a PS3 game in so 
that's the reason why I got this version. So now let's finally open this. All right, so we're gonna open the first seal. Here we go. All right, so it opened. All right, so I just got this plain white box. Is there anything in here? And there's nothing in there. But I'm definitely gonna keep this box. All right, so does this even have any like PS5 branding on it? Oh, it does. All right, so it looks like you have to open it from here. Oh my God, here we go, three, two, one. Oh my god, more boxes? What is this? Alright, so it looks like there's like this tab right here. We have to just open it, I guess. Oh, this is like a different compartment. Oh my god. I see it. I see the PS5 right there. Oh my god. Alright. So if you're a real unboxer, you gotta do what whatever it is inside of here first. So I'm pretty sure this is like all the cables and stuff. Maybe the controller. Oh my god. Okay, so we got this quick start guide that nobody reads. I don't care about that. What is in here? Oh, is this the is this the base? Oh, this is a PlayStation base. Look at that. This looks complicated. Let's see what else we get. HDMI cable. Oh, damn. These are like, these are like high quality HDMI cable. Okay, so this is, this is the power. I, I hope this uses like the same like outlet as the, my PS4 so I don't have to like uh, use this so hopefully I don't know if that works oh my god the controller I've never held the PS5 controller in my life this is gonna be the first time oh my god you see it oh my god Dang. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, damn, this feels nice. But I'm trying for tenants to see if like I'm playing a game. Oh, what the? Oh, at least. Oh, my God. PS5 ASMR. PS button. Oh, my God. It's like a. Damn. That... Oh, dang. It lights up. Damn, I like how they did the PS button. Let me see the back. There's the back. It uses like a USB-C. Might as well do a quick comparison. All right, the size. All right, so. And then here is the charger for the controller. All right, moment of truth. The PS5. Oh my god, I touched it. Alright, so is there anything in here? No empty box. Alright, here we go. Oh my god, I already see the PlayStation logo. This is a nice quality cardboard. All right, time to see the PS5 for the first time ever in my life. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh my God. This is real. I am actually holding a PS5 in my hand. Okay, hold on. Let me move this. Like I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger, but here we go. Let me put it on the put it on the stand. Look, that that's how it looks like standing up. Look at those curves. Look at those curves. I don't know if you guys can see it. Look at those curves. 
I'm gonna wipe it down. This is brand new. Oh my god. So there's a side. I wonder what that button is. Or oh, I don't even think that's a button. Here's the back. Look at that. I just I just noticed it has like I don't know if you can see that, but it has like PlayStation symbols on it. Nice Easter egg. You can literally see inside your the PS5. That's pretty crazy. Alright, so now I'm gonna put the stand on it because I have no idea how this goes. This thing looks complicated like I said, but let me actually figure it out. I just realized there's this random hole right here, like on the back. I have no idea what that is. Alright, so the base is tightly on there. Here's a size comparison, OG PS4 next to the PS5. And then here's the PS4 Pro. Yeah, I can see the PS5 is obviously taller. Look at that. Alright, so now I'm going to set this up to my monitor. Hopefully it uses the same cables as my OG PS4. So let's hook it up. Look how nice the PS5 looks like in my setup. Like the white with the white tabletop. With the white controller matching with the PS5. Like this looks really nice. So everything is set up. Like I said, hopefully the cables work with the with my old PS4. So I'm going to turn it on for the very first time. Monitor is on. Alright, here we go. 3, 2, 1. It has the same sound as the PS4. Okay, I thought it was going to be different. Oh my god, the lights are like glowing. I don't know. If, can you see it on the camera? Hopefully you can, but the lights are glowing. Or at least stay quiet so you guys can hear the... Oh my god, it's like the year 3000. Oh, okay, so it looks like I need to plug in the cable, which I have right here. Look at those animations. Damn, PlayStation. Alright. the controller to the console with the USB cable and press the PS button. Oh my god. Okay, damn, my PlayStation is impatient. Okay, here we go. That's what happens when it takes so long. Alright, here we go. And I'm gonna press the PS button. 3, 2, 1. Select your language. English, United States. Press the cross button to select English, United States. Why is it talking to me? Continue with the screen reader turned on. Conti no, turn off. Continue button. with the screen reader. Press cross to select. No, turn that off. <coughs> Adjust display area. Oh. And do it like that. Insert a game disc. If you have a game disc, insert it now. And we'll start it when you. When you continue with setup, I don't have a disc as of right now, so I'm just gonna continue. Standard time, power options for wrestling. Alright, I'm just gonna use optimized experience, because why not? I can let me read this word by word the terms of agreements. Hold on, just kidding, I'm just gonna press agree because no one reads that. Confirm. Oh my god, this is exciting. Alright, I'm just gonna continue with that. So I guess now we have to wait for this to update. Hopefully it doesn't take so long. Are you serious? This is gonna take an hour just to download. Alright, I'm just gonna do this later because my connection is being crap. So I'm gonna do it later. Add user. I'm just gonna put splits. That keyboard though. Okay, can I, I can't change my avatar. Alright, press OK. Data collection. Opens. Sure, confirm and continue. Oh my god.
So that's it. Oh my god, I'm in the PS5 menu. So this is how it looks like. Like I said, I haven't actually... I don't know how I feel about this menu. Like, it's so zoomed out. Like, I don't get why those apps are, like, so small. I'm not even sorry. Let me sign into my account. Alright, so it looks like I need, I need to update it, but I'm not going to do that right now. So let's see what we can do. Is there, like, settings or something? Oh, it's up here. Settings. Ooh, it kind of looks like the PS4. But there it is, the PS5 setup, all ready to go. I just need to update it, but I'm going to do that because it's later because it takes forever right now. So, yeah, there's the PS5. I got it launch day. This is how it looks like. So make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe for more PS5 videos. I'm going to do a lot. And, yeah.